I'm going to say on the low end. Lights. Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name. Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name. What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Hustle Cute, man. Back with another video. You know what it is, man. I got a little dumpster on for you, man. A few things I found. I actually found a lot, man, but I'm going to have to put it into like a two-part video. So look, man, shout out to the new subscribers that's subscribing, jumping on. I appreciate y'all. Make sure y'all hit that like button. I'm going to pause for a minute. Hit the like button. I'm not a loser. That's the L for the like. Anyway, <clears throat> um... Let me show you my first item I found in a dumpster. A uh, buddy of mine told me about it. He's a co-worker. I'm going to be honest with you. If it wasn't for my co-workers, man, I probably wouldn't be finding hardly any of this stuff, dude. Any of this stuff. Um, but I appreciate it, though, man. I'm going to show you a little clip. One thing is I did forget to film it while I was in the dumpster. We loaded everything up. And, and I said, damn, dude, I forgot to film it. He's like, do well, you want to take it back out? And I was like, hell no, this it was too heavy, man. It was a lot of books. But anyway, let me show you what I got. And um, after you see this clip, I'm going to just be honest with you. I'm guilty. I'm so, so guilty, man. But who ain't, right? <laughs> anyway, let's go, man. All right, YouTube. So check it out. My latest find, Dumpster Hall find, right here, man, from Fullerton Library that was in our zone. Some, new, um, some geographic books, National Drid Gap. Ah, Y'all know what I'm talking about, damn it. Anyway, found a gang of books, man. I was getting ready to film that I was picking these out, but I didn't. I just loaded them up in my car because I had to hurry up and go. Anyway, that's what I got. Let's see what's up. All right, y'all. So let me show you something. What's up, dude? Cash flow. That's yours, man. Come get it. Let's go. I'm coming to see you. Anyway, so look. Here's one of the books right here. This is one. It's in a leather case. Let me move this book right here. It's like six geographics for like the whole year or something like that. Maybe half the year or something. There is some are vintage. I think they're all vintage, but that's one of them. But let me show you what I'm guilty of right there. I did sell one already and I listed that one. Let me show you what's up. Are right, you two right here? It's two stacks. A little bit out of order. I still got to go through of them. They're not all complete. But I didn't list them. They haven't been listed yet. <laughs> they have not been listed. I'm guilty. All right, look. I understand. I get it, man. We get so much stuff and we don't tend to list it right away. I have been having those for a while. I am guilty. But I sold the first one. I'm going to try to post up a comp if I can find it. I think I sold it for like $12, $13. I charge about almost $11 in shipping. Um, I can't ship these media mail, so they go regular shipping, priority mail, or USPS, personal select, whatever. Um, but I did sell one. This is all profit. I just got to list them. I will be listing them. Now that this video is coming out about them, I will be listing them. But I'm thinking I got them free. Total profit. I'm an average. I'm Honestly, I'm going to say on the low end, on the low end. $150 profit right there. $150 profit right there. We're going to keep adding this up. Boom, $150 profit. Let me show you what else I found. Check this one out. Um, I don't even know which one to show you. I don't found so much stuff, and it's just, I've been, honestly, I've been sitting on it. Now it's time to list it. Um, you guys know I got those all those Bibles. That will probably be in the next one. But I've been listing those Bibles like crazy, and they've been selling off the rack, man. I'm telling you, it's, it's a beautiful thing. Anyway, let's jump to the next one. Let's go. Ooh, she just got a tip. Just got a tip. There was a Tony Hawk bike in here. Never knew Tony Hawk had a bike. But let's see what we find. Let's see what's up now. Let's see if it's still in here. That damn sure ain't it. Boom, there it is. This is Tony Hawk. I think this could be worth some money. Just the frame alone would be worth some money, I think. Damn. I gotta grab it. All right, YouTube fam. Look, I know I'm guilty. Just say, damn, Q, what's up, man? But look, let me just show y'all this real quick. 
I got new racks. They're not new. My neighbor gave them to me before they moved out. My plan is to put all these racks up against these walls and set everything you see down over here on top of the racks. I just cleaned out my other garage pretty much where I can start moving stuff over there and bringing it back over here neatly. Trust me. I don't even trust myself. All right, anyway, so look, man. There is a Tony Hawk bike right here, man. This is the bike frame. This is going to be listed on Facebook Marketplace. Um, I'm going to go 50 bucks probably. I don't think they're really... I thought they was worth a lot of money, but I don't think they're worth that much. I didn't know Tony Hawk even had a bike frame. I didn't even think he made bikes. I thought it was skateboards. But those are original pegs, original pedals. Everything's original on it, as far as I know. Um, I looked it up, but they're not worth this much. Um, this is going to be someone else's project, man. Trust me, guys. I'm getting it together. <laughs> Trust me. Let's go. I get it. I understand. But I am promise you, it's about to get listed. I ain't playing around no more. Ain't nobody playing. That was a scene from a movie. Y'all know what scene that movie was from? Because I'm trying to be an actor someday. Anyway... So that Tony Hawk bike, yeah, I'm going to list that on Facebook Marketplace. It's going to be right here on this table. This is my listing table for all big items. It's going down, all right? So that's going to be listed. We're going on from there. I'm thinking I'm going to list it at 75 and take the best offer. I'm going to try to post up some comps on certain other Tony Hawk bikes. Again, I didn't know, but I'm thinking in that type of condition, I probably won't be able to get much. I'll go 75, take the best offer. It's going to be somebody else's project. Not mine. I don't have time to try to search for parts and put that together. I'd rather let someone else do it. Someone else might want to do it. All right, y'all, look. Check it out. This next item I'm about to show you, <laughs> let's figure it out. Let's go, man. Crazy. Guilty. Are right, you two. So, look, man. Back with another dumpster haul. So, check it out, man. I just saw the guy. He's throwing this out. I don't even know what this is. I'm going to have to look that up. And then my neighbor said he just threw away a metal detector. So, it's supposed to be a metal detector in here. He said it works. Look at the stand right here, man. Table throwing away everything. I look old school. The glass. Let's check this out. All right, so here it is, man. It says metal detector on there. That's what it looks like. Look like it has a screen. Now, the guy that gave this to me is the same dude that gave me that Dodger bobblehead that sold right away. Um, check out my videos for that one. I don't know what video it was on. But anyway, he said it works. He said the reason why he threw out a lot of good stuff, but I missed out on it. Um, he threw a lot of big stuff out. But he said this works. He just got a better one, he said. And um, I don't know. This is my first time opening it up. So I'm doing it with y'all, man. I'm doing it with one hand, though. All right. So let's see what it is, man. Okay. All right. Hold up. He left a hat in here that says lights. Okay, we, 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 <laughs> hold on, hold on. All right, um, we're going to see what this is about, this hat. I will be looking up this hat. What is that about, whites? What is that symbol? Anybody know? Cause a little sussy right there. But anyway, let's keep it going, y'all. Let's see. Dude, he's got the instruction. Oh, <laughs> wait a minute, hold up. It's right there. I'm tripping, Doc. I'm about to say, what's up, man? What's what's what you what's up, man? You got one of those robes? I don't know what the hell was going on. Man. It said whites. I don't know what's up. But anyway, that's the name of the dang thing. All right, here's hey, look, operator manual. That's good to have that. Uh whites authorized service center. You can got a number to call. And what's this? Oh, this is dope, dude. I might want to keep this, though, man. Let me see. Tra look, Trash, Treasure, Boeing's Hideout, Spoken, Washington. That's nice. He got a little everything in here, man. <laughs> Whites. <laughs> Y'all know what? All right. Oh, damn. We got the headphones. I feel like something's missing. But he got the headphones. This is the um. Okay, so that's the volume on it. Normal. Okay, so you know I'm gonna definitely have to do some research. One to make sure everything is here, which he said it was. 
and I believe this is the thing that's going to do it, whites. Okay. <laughs> anyway, this is the pole. Pretty sure that goes together. Um, I'm going to figure out how it goes. I got the manual with it. The headphones. Headphones look to be in very good condition. Got the jack right there. The plug in to... Um, I'm pretty sure it's going to plug in... Oh, right there. That's where the jack's going to plug in for you to listen. I'm just hoping there's nothing missing because, I mean, I'm pretty sure this is the headphone, but it looked like it should have been something there. There's something there. There's nothing there. Let me see. Nothing underneath. But, yeah, okay. It looks to be good. I mean, it ain't like the one that has a screen on it, so you got to listen for it. Um, and that's what it should look like. What this dude is holding right now with the handle. He ain't got the headphones on. But that's it, man. Damn. I'm going to post up some comps to see what this could be worth and how much money y'all see. Even I'm going to throw in the hat because it was looking kind of sussy. But we're going to throw in the hat too. It might be vintage. I don't know. But now that I know what's brand it is and everything, White's 2500D. Um, coin master. Oh, I like that metal detector. This mob, this, I mean, this looks, dude, there's not even no scratches on it. I mean, if anything, I'm putting scratches on it, man. Let's go. All right, YouTube. So, I was busy checking out the metal detector. Great find. The shout out to my neighbor. He moved away already. Um, he gave it to me. I double checked it. I think all the parts are there. I, I looked up some. I'm going to show some comps right here. No solds on this particular brand. Um, I want to say it's vintage. No solds on that particular brand. But I got two comps I found from 75 to 100. Um, the 500 series. This is a 2500 series. 500 series sold. The 5000 series sold. Other series sold. But no. I think what I'm going to do. I probably put it on Facebook Marketplace. Or I'll probably do an eBay auction on it and see where it goes from there. And I'll probably start to bid off at 50 bucks. I got it for free. So, again, on the National Geographic books, 150 bucks. The Tony Hawk bike, I'm thinking 50 bucks. That's 200 right there. The metal detector, let's add another 50 bucks on a metal detector. That's on the low end. So, we're looking at $255 potential profit. Don't get me wrong potential profit will take time for this stuff to sell as long as i list it right so there you have it man that's my dumpster haul for you guys today hope you guys enjoy the video man um we figure out whites is the name brand of it it's whites uh 2500 d series coin master so i'm glad i'm actually gonna like put it all together i just want to make sure the parts are there i think i'm gonna i'm gonna put it together and to make sure it works so i can put test it and works great um, and it looks really clean. Comes with the bag and all. So, without further ado, $250 profit. Potential mate. Potential profit. <laughs> all right? Anyway, guys, please hit that like button, man. Share this video out. Do what you got to do. It's your boy, Hustle Q, man. I'm out. Peace.